signs that this morning government ministers negotiating the Trans-Pacific Partnership, the TPP trade agreement, up against yet another deadline. They're hoping to ink a deal by today. The representatives from 12 countries are meeting in Hawaii, in Maui, in fact, on Maui. But there are still issues outstanding intellectual property, IP, Australian sugar, and Canadian dairy. Experts say that after years of talks, they need to make a deal. But, well, they still may need more time. Take a look. It's really critical that we get the TPP done. The, the TPP is the first 21st century multilateral FTA. It addresses market access issues and non-tariff barriers. It, it combines some of the largest economies in the world with some of the fastest growing economies in the world. And if you can get a comprehensive agreement with those types of players, you really have a very powerful win-win. Uh, my personal view is that the chances are less than 50-50 that that will happen tomorrow. Uh, whether that will happen uh, if they stay a couple of additional days, time will tell. If, if not, uh, they'll have to reschedule another meeting, uh, send everybody home, let them talk to their chiefs of state, and then come back and try one more time. Okay, now, uh, here's the thing. If they do manage to get it done, get a deal, the TPP agreement would be nothing short of, well, huge. The 12 economies represent about 800 million consumers combined GDP, 28 trillion U.S. dollars, and if you want me to do the math for you, I will. That's basically 40% of world GDP, folks.